can you be the best girlfriend in the world and please go get the door? Hi. Uh, hello? How did you... Yeah, we knocked, but you didn't. Um, and your girlfriend left us these. Did she hire you, or... Because she's not here, and she didn't leave a note. Is there something broken? Yeah, in a manner of speaking, yes. It's moving day, bud. Your girlfriend's dumped you. What is wrong with you? I told you, don't pull that stuff. My name is Mason, and this here is my trainee, Nikki. It's Nick now. What? Not Nikki. I'm not a kid anymore, Mace. It's Nick now. Fine. Me and Nick now are gonna... Aunt Robin said you'd be cool. Did she also say it'd be cool just to walk up to a complete stranger and just tell him he's been dumped? Can we get back to that? I hate to start your day like this, but as Nick now so delicately put it in a way completely opposite to the manual, we're here to facilitate your move. Yeah, well, we're not moving, so thank you. That's cute. He still thinks he's a we. Uh, you see, we work for a company called Moving On, and we provide a special kind of service to people who are about to enter a new phase in their lives. We were hired by your now ex-girlfriend, Elizabeth. Yeah, but Lizzie didn't say anything about a breakup. She never mentioned anything. Yeah, she hired us to do it. We're here to get your shit out of your girlfriend's apartment because she's not your girlfriend anymore and you don't live here. Nikki. What? This is a rip the bandaid off kind of moment. Just show him the papers. What is this? Where does she expect me to go? My mom's place? And you didn't think this is something I needed to know? No, 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 no. I don't care what she said. You're my mom. Take me? No. Hilarious. Now tape the box, funny guy. You take this too seriously. You don't take this serious enough. Hey, I'm gonna call her. I wouldn't. You should, don't, okay. <laughs> she changed her number. Mm -hmm. People are uh, uncomfortable with confrontation. Yeah, she just wants a clean break. It happens all the time. No, 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 not to me, okay? Not right now. This is a big misunderstanding. We had a trip planned to wine country. I think we got enough wine right here. Huh? Take the box. You know, I'm the one that found this place. It's a goddamn duplex. Why do I have to move out? Transition. Transition. I still don't get it. You know, she wants out so bad. Why doesn't she move out? It's transition, dude. Maybe your bad listening skills had something to do with it. What kind of girl would do this? break up with someone using a moving company. Maybe someone who doesn't deserve you in the first place. Or someone who's a raging bitch. Hey, come on, yes. we want to try to stay neutral here. Okay. No, 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 you're right. I know I'm right, Ross. You deserve better. There's a silver lining here. No, there's no lining. Nick now is right. Great, that's still a thing? Let's see her drink the coffee I make her every morning without my mugs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Those are, I, I, see, you do that, you won't be able to drink your own coffee either. That's a good point. Huh? Yeah, pack it up. <laughs> pack it all up. Pack everything up. Yeah. Okay, well, actually, we have a list of uh, what's hers and what's yours, so we're only gonna we're only gonna pack up what's yours. So. Okay, then. Pack all mine up. Thank you. Oh, what is it gonna take to get her new number? It's against company policy to contact the ex while the move. The is... transition. While the transition is in progress. Right, guys, guys, we're buds, right? Hmm. You can make an exception. Ten bucks. <laughs> you're right, you're right. Fifty bucks. Huh? Everyone's happy. No less than a hundred. Nikki! What? What are you doing? I thought that look was to raise the price. No! Well, get your looks straight. That's it. I'm gonna die alone. Come on, you know that's not true. That's not true. I still have Inky Binky. Do I want to know what that is? No, it's not a what, it's a who. Inky Binky's the dog. Wait a second. 
You named the dog Inky Binky? No, no, no. I named the dog Stan. Lizzie changed it to Inky Binky, but at least I have my best friend, right? Yeah. Uh, about that. She took the dog. <sighs> that is cold, dude. This is the worst day of my life. No, or the best. Look, you're free now, man. Free to get a new dog, free to name it something not completely ridiculous. You're free to go where the wind takes you. Go where the wind takes you? I don't know. Jesus. All right, look, Ross, you gotta change. Where do I start? What am I even changing? Your clothes, Ross. I'm gonna need you to change your clothes. We're about to pack up the wardrobe. So how much does a service like this cost anyway? It's not cheap. Hmm. Wow. Elizabeth must have really wanted to be gone because she never pays for a thing, ever. You know my car once got booted because she refused to pay parking tickets? 34 of them. All that she got while driving it. Seriously? Seriously. Can't believe I forgot about that until now. You know when my grandfather passed away, she refused to answer her cell phone because she thought the phone calls might be a little depressing. She used to say that she might be a lesbian because she fell in love with such a pussy. Hmm. Huh. What a bitch. I thought we were supposed to keep it neutral. No, she she did you a favor by leaving you. Jesus. Thank you, Mason. What do you do? No, we got everything on the list. What are you looking for? Nothing important. Just thought maybe uh, she told you where she's been keeping my balls all these years. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, sign here, and the first day of the rest of your life can begin. Can't say I pictured the beginning back at my mom's place. Oh, your, your former life started here. Yeah, look where that one ended up. Seriously, we don't take them out for a drink? I mean, you're getting that a shot at breakup sex. That is definitely not part of the service. It should be. All right, here we go. No, but that's for you. you. And that's for you. Here, here you go, buddy. No, come on, Mason. It's on the house. Oh. Hey, don't worry, man. It gets better. Okay. That's Tate. He's one of my first transitions, so, yeah. Well, hey, I didn't know if I was going to be saying this at one point today, but thanks, guys. To Mason and Nick now. Hey, who'd still be with his mom if it wasn't for me? To Mason and Nick. There we go. Better. All right. <laughs> Wait. We need to commemorate this with a picture. All right. Oh, dude, you stole your ex's birth control pills? That's a new one. These are, these are. Mine. I'm so sorry. I accidentally like it's in your coat pocket. Yeah. I think it's only fair if you're going to know it's in mine that I know it's in yours. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I was hoping for something a little more embarrassing. Yeah. Can I have a piece? Only if I can have a piece of yours. <laughs> Just keep it uh, you, you know, the only reason I have these is because I have a boyfriend. I'm not a whore. Wow. You just say things. <laughs> I, I figure we've been in each other's pockets. Um, we're past pleasantries. Right? True. Very true. Are we, are we past names? Annie. Hi. Hello. Nice to meet you, Annie. I'm Ross. Pleasure. Uh, if I may be so bold. No. Um, you're glowing. Glowing. Did you forget to take your pill? Uh, no, I, I don't know why I'd be I'd be glowing. Uh, my girlfriend of five years broke up with me today. You look so happy. I had a little bit of help with my transition. OK, we well, have to tell me your secret, because I've been trying to break up with my boyfriend for a really long time, oh. and he keeps talking me back into staying. And... Mm. I think you need a little help moving on. Yeah, yeah, he's here. Hold on a second. You're not my weed guy. Good morning, 
Mr. Lee. My name is Nick, and this is my partner Mason, and we're here to- Listen, if the next words out of your mouth aren't sell me weed, I don't give a shit. <sighs> it's moving day, bud. Your girlfriend's dumping you. Boom.